guys welcome to another tutorial of mine today I'm gonna show you guys how I color or how I dye my hair at home so first off the color that I'm using is the Revlon luxurious color silk um, this it has a better cream so that's why I chose this it's actually very healthy for your hair um, as the fact that it's a color hair color and um, the best thing about this is it has the mango to nourish your hair it has the shade to hydrate and the coconut to condition your hair I'm using number 54 G it's in light golden so it comes with the developer the number one and number two it comes with the actual color they call it the nourishing cream color so this is the difference between the other color which is liquid this is actually cream so it's better for your hair and like other color treatment it comes with the conditioner which is number three and of course the instruction so first off uh, you're gonna go ahead and read the instruction and then it comes with a glove so I'm already wearing my gloves okay so number one take the uh, developer and cut the head and then put the nourishing cream color inside the developer make sure you put everything inside so you're gonna open the color with something sharp I'm using a scissors here just be careful okay so number three you're gonna put the color inside the developer and like I said, make sure you put everything inside. And then shake, shake, shake everything together, the developer and the color itself. So after a long time of shaking, it should show some color um, like so on the bottle. Then go ahead and section your hair and start uh, putting the uh, color on it. So this coloring is mainly root touch up for me so that's why I'm focusing on the roots mostly for this video. And to be honest with you guys, actually this is not the best tutorial that I'm doing. Um, it's actually kind of messy but I did the best I could to show you guys how I dye my hair. Um, just make sure that when you put, put in the color on your roots, um, actually you can go ahead and massage the color into your roots. And if you have sensitive scalp, I actually do have sensitive scalp but um, this color actually is fine for me, it doesn't burn at all. So um, just make sure that you are actually massaging the color into your roots and uh, in case you feel any burning just wash it right away because you might be uh, allergic to the color but this actually works very well for me. So yeah as you can see I'm just massaging everything into my roots and doing everything section by section everything's gonna be the same exactly the same way um, from now on I'm just gonna section some hair strand of hair and then you know massaging the color into my roots so as you can see I'm putting like tons and tons of colors into my roots right now just to make sure that you know I'm not missing any parts and things like that okay so I'm really sorry guys if this seems a little boring with the voiceover because I really don't want to put any music in the background just because of copyrights and things like that but um, I hope this video is still helpful for you guys though And also make sure that the area next to your ears is actually uh, covered with color because 
if you're putting your hair up in a high ponytail or things like that actually that part is gonna show so make sure that you don't miss that part okay so for the rest of the uh, hair which is the back of my head um, actually I am um, put in the colors on the gloves first and then I'm rubbing it on my hair after I'm gonna show that to you guys uh, shortly but um, that's the technique that I do because I cannot see it since it's the back of my hair back of my head so there you go I'm just massaging the color into the um, the hair and this is another technique too just put the hair on the opposite side and then you can just massage it on top of your head all right so just moving on to the next uh, part of hair this is just a random sections by the way I don't have any specific sections here I'm just you know doing the best I can to actually be able to dye every single part of my head I have quite a lot of hair, as you can notice. So, um, for the bottom of my head, I'm actually putting the uh, product, the color, into my gloves I guess and then just rubbing it on the uh, roots of my hair which is the back of my head and then just massaging it there and then working my way up as you can see on the video Alright, so for, like I said, the back of my hair, um, I'm actually uh, just massaging it, uh, starting from the roots and then massaging it down, just like how you put, you would put your conditioner into your hair. So just slowly, but instead of starting from the tips, um, you're starting from the roots and massaging the product down to your hair. And doing the same exact thing on, you know, the rest of your hair. Okay, actually guys, this is pretty self-explanatory. I think the video uh, shows you everything, pretty much everything here. So, I'm going to go ahead and... Um, fast forward this whole thing and then I'm just gonna explain the rest of the video at the end
Okay, so for finishing up here, I am just basically putting like the rest of the products towards, uh, I guess, the end of my hair. I'm putting it as a ponytail, which is easier. Um, just, you know, massaging everything on my scalp and then um, putting the rest of the product on the back of my hair or the back of my head. Um, yeah, so it's pretty much just, you know, finishing up. As you can see right there. And then I'm just clipping everything back up. And then I'm just gonna finish it up uh, by cleaning my face. Um, actually here I'm using a makeup remover to clean up anything that might have gotten on my face. <laughs> Any uh, color I guess works very well um, I next suggest you just clean it up right away so we're gonna wait 25 minutes and then rinse your hair and use number three which is the conditioner and here we are with the end result okay to be honest I filmed this video like <laughs> And I don't know like three weeks later but as you can see the color is still vibrant it's still nice looking natural looking uh, yeah so this is pretty much it thank you so much guys for watching don't forget to comment rate and subscribe uh, subscribe because I'm gonna do a giveaway pretty soon on this channel so yeah stay tuned for that and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.